Have you ever wondered who the most feared and respected warriors were in the Viking society? In the tumultuous times of the Viking era, one group of warriors stood head and shoulders above the rest, the Viking Berserkers. These fierce fighters were not just soldiers, they were champions, often leading the charge in battles and raids. Berserkers held a unique position within Viking society, a mixture of awe, respect and fear. Their legendary status was not unfounded. Known for their ferocity and fearlessness, they were the stuff of sagas, the heroes of epic tales and the nightmare of their enemies. They were not just respected within their own ranks, though. Even their adversaries acknowledged their might, often with a mix of dread and admiration. Their reputation was such that just the mention of berserkers could send a chill down the spine of the bravest warriors. And so, the stage is set introducing us to these formidable warriors, the Viking Berserkers. What set Berserkers apart was their infamous rage, but what really caused this seemingly supernatural state? This is a question historians and enthusiasts alike have been trying to answer for centuries. Berserker rage, as it's known, was a trance-like fury that transformed these Viking warriors into seemingly invincible forces on the battlefield. Historical accounts describe berserkers as howling wild animals, biting their shields and charging fearlessly into enemy lines. But what was behind this? Was it simply a psychological phenomenon, a state of mind honed through years of brutal warfare, or perhaps something more? Some theories suggest that this rage could have been induced not just by their mental conditioning, but also by external factors, possibly even substances. The Berserker Rage remains a mystery, a blend of historical accounts and modern interpretations, leaving us to wonder about the true nature of their fury. As we delve deeper into the world of the Berserkers, we continue to uncover the layers of their legendary status. Could it be possible that the Berserkers' legendary rage was fueled by hallucinogenic mushrooms? A theory that's been floating around suggests that these formidable warriors might have consumed Amanita muscaria, also known as the fly agaric mushroom, to induce their trance-like state. Let's delve into the effects of this particular mushroom. When consumed, Amanita muscaria can cause hallucinations, feelings of euphoria, and even a sense of superhuman strength, traits that are eerily similar to the descriptions of berserkers in the throes of their battle rage. It's not hard to see how the consumption of these mushrooms could have influenced the Berserkers' behavior and abilities in combat, turning them into the fearsome warriors that we've come to know through history. While it's a theory that stirs debate, the idea of Berserkers battling on magic mushrooms adds another layer to their already captivating story. What do the artifacts and scholarly debates tell us about the Berserkers and their possible use of magic mushrooms? Let's navigate through this intriguing enigma. The archaeological record does not offer a clear-cut answer. Some artifacts, like Viking Age combs, bear images of warriors with what could be interpreted as mushroom caps, but this is speculative at best. Moreover, there's a dearth of physical evidence, like remnants of Amanita muscaria, in Viking archaeological sites. In the realm of scholarly debates, opinions are divided. Some historians argue that the berserker rage could be attributed to the hallucinogenic properties of these mushrooms. Yet others contend that it was likely brought on by ritualistic practices, psychological conditioning or even mental disorders. This lack of consensus underscores the complexities of historical interpretation. It reminds us that the past is not always clear-cut and the truth often comprises multiple perspectives and interpretations. As with any historical interpretation, the truth about berserkers and their possible use of magic mushrooms lies somewhere among the artifacts, scholarly debates and our own imagination. From historical legends to modern pop culture, how have Viking berserkers left their mark? Their influence is far-reaching, transcending time and space. The Viking berserkers, with their fearsome reputation and mystical aura, have seeped into our collective consciousness manifesting in various forms of popular culture. Their tales of unbridled fury and superhuman strength resonate with us, sparking intrigue and fascination. You'll find them in literature, depicted as fierce warriors cloaked in animal skins, their eyes ablaze with an otherworldly glow. On the silver screen, they are often portrayed as unstoppable forces of nature, their berserker rage becoming a symbol of raw, untamed power. 
And in the realm of video games, players can embody these legendary figures experiencing their battle trance firsthand. Their legacy lives on, the Viking berserkers, forever etched in our collective imagination, continuing to inspire and intrigue us even today.